really shot a lot of nights in the elements, in the rain, used everything that we could to really feel like we were in this There's world. a lot of hot water bottles yes. at the start, <laughs> really interesting because obviously there are books, there are video games that already depict the world in one way. Um, you know, we obviously went back to, to the books themselves for descriptions of the world. Um, the fun thing is that the continent isn't in our understanding of time, our like human understanding of time. You don't get to align it. It's not medieval. You don't get to align it with any historical events. So we really had this big, wide open, um, uh, so many choices. And our production designer, when he came in, Andrew Laws, um, basically I said that one of the things I was most interested in doing is using real locations, being practical, not doing everything CG. So we started to talk about if we were shooting in some place and the building was a gothic style, then we would talk about like where was the Witcher's gothic period? What was that marked by? So we started to align the history of our world, which is sets and props and costumes, and then try to align them with changes that are happening in the continent and, and make up basically our own time. Um, I mean, everything is from, obviously we have the best team imaginable and the, like, the imaginations of our costume designer and of our production designer and art director, they're, they're pretty, they're pretty stunning. <laughs> yeah, like people always ask me, how, did you have to work with like a lot of green screen and I really didn't. I, I always felt really, it was created around me with the costumes as well and yeah, going on to set, you really do f feel like you're in that world. It's amazing. And we shot in five different countries. Um, you know, we shot in, mainly in Hungary, but we also shot in Poland. We shot in the Canary Islands. We shot in London a little bit, um, and we shot in Vienna. And so we also, I mean, we were like hanging off the sides of mountains occasionally and on black sand beaches and, you know, hiking up places. It was really, it was immersive. And I think, you know, what Frey is saying about being cold at night, um, that was a lot of it too. We shot a lot of nights in the elements, in the rain, used everything that we could to really feel like we were in this There's world. a lot of hot water bottles yes. at the start, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, um, the very first thing I did when I sold the series is I flew to Poland. I met with the author, um, Andrzej Sapkowski, and um, I basically toured around the country just to see what there was. And amazingly, um, uh, a Grozhnik castle we ended up shooting at. It was one of the very first places I visited and I took a ton of pictures because it was so beautiful. And all through the season we just kept thinking like, what, what could that be for us? Um, and we ended up premiering it in the, uh, in the season finale. So that was very important.